how do you divide equity at the very beginning? There's really two schools of thought. One school of thought believes that, hey, everyone should be 50-50 or 33, 33, 33. Or on the other hand, you could say, oh, well, what is each person bringing to the table and try to assign a value to that and split it up that way. No matter which way you choose, and it's very difficult to tell you one's right or, or wrong, the most important thing to do, which I can be very confident telling you you need to take care of, is vest the equity. Do not give out the equity all at once to any founder. You need to make sure that this equity is vesting over a period of time so everyone is incentivized to continue to work for the company. There's a time release to the vesting, which is critical to protect your interests. This is important because if someone, let's say, gets cold feet or things change or they say, hey, I need, I have a family to support, I can't continue doing this, they can exit and they won't have that, those million shares that now you have to figure out how to get back. When you do decide to vest shares, you really need to fill out the 83B election. This cannot be overemphasized because so many startup founders have run into issues of paying enormous taxes when there's potentially a liquidity event or an exit because they did not file the 83B election correctly. The 83B election is a simple form that most attorneys should give you or however you set up your company that allows you to pay the taxes on your shares uh, up front rather than as they vest. This means that when the value of your company is very low, you can pay those, uh, pay those taxes now and avoid having to pay the taxes as the shares vest, which means that as your company valuation increases, the value of those shares will increase and now all of a sudden you have to pay taxes on that. So really important, you know, no matter whether you decide to set up a company uh, and issue equity equally or based on the value of what person's bringing to the table, You've got to make sure you have vesting agreements in place and also file that A3B election. Carbon Law Group, the law firm for deal makers and risk takers. Book your free consultation now.